Hello everyone and welcome back to Chronos Plays Final Fantasy V. Today, we're going to be making our way through the ship graveyard. But first, I changed Bart's over to a monk. So he gained a level on the blue mage and I figured let's move him over to the monk. Ferris is one point away from becoming a thief. Uh, I might actually wait to change him over until after the ship graveyard because the night's really good around here. And while you can steal some stuff, I would rather the damage output from the night. Now, if you examine this rock down here, you play hopscotch over the freaking rocks, and you get a flail. Uh, flail is a back row item. It's hard to explain. So it's a mace. Like, y'all know what a flail is. But it's something the white mages can use from the black uh, back row. <laughs> and uh, does full amount of damage. All right, so now we got to journey through these little pathways. Now, it's not that confusing, and our first random encounter of skeletons. Not too, too bad. Uh, Bart's is going to be, be wrecking face, and if you want to have your black mage uh, using fire, you, you can do a lot of damage here as well. Uh, the white mage with the flail will be pretty strong, too. Oh, we're just getting the white one, black one, and cover. I'm, yeah, I'll put that on, Ferris. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep him over as a knight for now, because there's definitely... It's just easier with the knife. Uh, knight, not knife. If you were using a thief, it would be a knife. Go over here real fast. That's not what I wanted. I want to go down here and get this chest. It's a tent. Not actually going to be too useful in this area just yet. But, in the future, it will be. Do we have to go this way? We'll get soaked. What, are you gonna melt or something? Come on. Now, uh, some people just don't like getting wet, Bart. Don't be so insensitive. I remember on the Super Nintendo emulators in the day that you could not really see what's going on in this area. I'm just going to leave this in because he'll be dead pretty soon. I mean, the one thing with this uh, this version of the game is with the, the auto battle is random encounters go really fast. And while, sure, we could just cut it. I'm even pausing through the trans uh, screen transition like I'm going to have to stop talking and cut out the battle and yet it would take me less time just to do this. So we got a new enemy here. Uh, Kalthuthu? I don't even know how to pronounce that. Anyways, they're pretty strong against magic, so don't use magic on them. I will take care of that skeleton in the back. Don't worry too much about your MP either. We're going to have a spot to refill it in uh, probably about a second or two after this. And we'll just hit auto battle. That should be enough for Ferris and Lena to kill that monster. And I believe that's it for treasure right now. Yes, okay. And let's just go through here. Oh, wait, no, it's not. There's one more treasure. All the treasure. And a potion. Lovely. Now that's the end of the waterway. I'm soaked. Yeah, there's a fish in my tr shorts. This room seems safe enough. Let's take a rest. I'm gonna go change into dry clothes. No peeking. Also, where are we getting the dry clothes from, everyone? You were all just submerged in water. How do you have dry clothes on you? There'd be no point of just stopping the dry off if you already had dry clothes with you. Maybe she meant go dry off. Like, she's gonna go start a fire in that room away from the guys. Okay, time to get dry. I'm fine like this. Don't worry about me. Are you crazy, boy? You'll catch a pneumonia of those wet things. Hey, what are you doing? Get away! Don't touch! What's all the commotion? Yo! Lena, this... He... 
on my stars and comets, he's a she! Well, maybe I am. You got a problem with it? Of course not, just why were you trying to hide it? When I was, uh, just a lad, uh, lass, a pirate band took me in. I've been one of them ever since. Yeah, so? Well, would you want to be the only girl on a ship full of pirates? Ha! Huh. I knew from the start you were too pretty to be a man. Phew! Anyhow, making fun of me for real being a woman and I'll shiver your timbers for good. Uh... Okay. That's right. It's okay. Now, I'm turning in. New lots had better just best do the same. I like Ferris. He's definitely one of my favorite characters out of the Final Fantasy series. Also, it took a lot for me to not refer to her as a her. Ah, slept like a log. Rise and shine, dull words. Time's a-wasting. Dullards? I think it was. Maybe I misspelled that. Hey, old man. That's enough lollygagging from the likes of you. On your feet, let's go. Bah. You aren't gonna dress like a girl. And you should. A real shame to hide such assets. You could at least talk like one. No point in trying to change her. Ferris is who she is. That's for certain. So yeah, definitely referring to Ferris as male for the first part of the game actually was kind of tricky for me. Oh, here's a save part if you need it. I don't need it right now. But yeah, for the first part of the game, I, I it was surprisingly hard to refer to her as a him. Even though the game never indicates that he is really a she. And, yeah, there it is. But, I don't know. It was just maybe because I've played the game so often and I know her real gender. It's, it's just really hard for some reason. Come on, there we go. That is the first random battle that I'm going to actually have to cut out. That thing took forever. Now let's go down here. Guys, this is the right way, not that way. Got two daggers from that fight. I don't think we can do anything with them. I guess we can equip one on Galuf. Yeah, this is so weird. I never got two daggers from uh, the skeletons before. Anyways, we want to go to here because there's some treasure. First off, this world map! Did the game freeze? No, it didn't. Alright. That actually worried me for a second there. Now we get an antidote. Awesome. Another antidote. Awesome. Ah, oh, fuck. A phoenix down? I wanted another antidote. Nah, actually, the phoenix down is way more valuable than an antidote, seeing how we have the spells to cure poison. Which is always hard for me to say. Po poisona? Poisona? Ah, screw it. An interesting chest. What pirate ship would have a chest that submerges the goddamn ship? Something's fishy in about this place, and it ain't cod. I- that just... I just realized, oh my god, I thought of- that's dumb. Barts. Anyways. Barts, come closer. It's your mother. Mom? No, oh, he's floating. That's interesting. I'm sure he does that all the time. Come here, honey. Father. Let Lena.
I don't know how to voice her. Um, well, we could do the Rydia thing where I talk like this, but uh, I don't want to do that. Oh, well, anyways. Grandpa, over here. Who's that? I just can't remember. No, oh, that, that's probably not good. Also, Gallif, do something. Don't just stand there, jeez. Just let us have your soul. Become one of us. Demon, what are you? Oh, I didn't expect any of you to escape the effects of my magic. Greetings, I am Siren. I'm afraid your companion souls now belong to me. Still, I'm feeling generous. I could be convinced to spare yours if you ran home quietly. You think I would abandon these kids? Fat chance, Missy. Why would you risk your life for these people? Because they're my friends. They're also the only people I actually know. Don't be fooled by her trickery. Open your eyes. Hmm. It's kind of dirty. Because you are clearly slapping their asses. I like how Ferris and Leonard are just staring at each other. Can you believe that motherfucker just slapped our asses? And Bart's like, yeah, I want some more. Bart snapped out of it. Lena came to our senses. Ferris leaves her trance. Okay, game. Galuff. Incoming. And we're going up against Siren. Now, Siren's... Haste right off the bat, man. Fuck you. So Siren here has 900 HP and is the most challenging boss to date. She can hit pretty hard. In her human form, she is fairly weak to physical attack, but strong to magic. You know what? Let me show you. Zero damage. Impressive, isn't it? Crap. Bart's fell asleep. Eh, he'll wake up soon, but it's annoying. All right. She is now one of the undeads. Now we don't want to kill her. But she is now very strong against physical attacks and weak against fire. We want to do some damage to her and then kill her when she transforms back into the ow. Back into the human. We're going to have Lena cure us, I think. Venomous. You sack of crap. Let's do this. Don't really like using my Phoenix down so early on. Normally it's not an issue, but then again, normally I have like a party of like full. You don't do that. Why would you do that? I will use all my Phoenix downs necessary. And we'll just no more on bars. You really want Siren to get back into our human form so we can like start punching her in the face. There we go. She does have haste on. Oh, she cast haste again. That's fair. If I had focus, it would be a little bit better for the monk. Oh, that critical hit. Nah, magic won't do anything to her. But I guess you might as well do something. Oh, that's not good. Protect is not good. She became one of the undead again. Please don't kill her, Bart. That shouldn't kill her. How much health does this lovely, lovely Siren have? Level 2, 212. Vulnerable to fire. I could hit her with another fire spell. And she'll live. And then next time, she will be dead when she gets to her human form. Please don't do that to the monk. As you can see, the monk, while strong, has very limited defense. And maybe I'm a tad under level two for this. I wouldn't think so. We're actually... We're doing all right in levels, I think. But this boss fight is a lot harder than the last boss fight we had. Uh, nope, we just do one on that. 
Okay, transform back, please. Thank you. That's right, she still has her haste up, but it doesn't matter. I think Ferris just critted. Not haste, to protect. Yeah, Siren's the first real hard boss of the game. Then again, she's the second, third, third boss of the game. You're right, third boss. And we just got Focus, which is an ability for the monk. We got bronze armor for that, that we're going to put on Ferris. But uh, Focus is a... I'll explain after this. Galif, you saved us. I owe you my life. Well, so he repaid you one saving. He now owes you one, Bartz. Ah, don't sweat it. Aw, are you blushing? I'm doing nothing of the sort. I just have high blood pressure. I am an old man, you know, you bastards. Alright. So, focus is a skill for the monk. It is pretty much you take longer to attack, but you hit twice as hard. It's not as good as, like, the Final Fantasy IV DS focus, but it is about on par with the 2D version focus. I am going to put that on him, even when I switch classes with him. He'll probably still have that. And I think... Yeah, we'll switch. We'll leave here <laughs> with poison. Uh, we did get bronze armor. That's the best reward. You can get a bronze shield if you kill her undead form. But bronze armor is one, more expensive, and two, just straight up better uh, than the bronze seals. But it's not going to be quite as useful yet. Actually, no, that's not true at all, because I will be switching over to a blue mage for Bartz, who will be able to equip it, while Ferris will be going over to a thief. And that's going to be it for this episode, so thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, press the like button below. If you're not subscribed yet, why don't you head over to my video section, and check out some of my other content, and see if it's to your liking. Once again, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you all next time. Also, you can see up in the left, upper left-hand corner that we now have a world map. Go us!